All right, good evening and welcome to uh, 3R Yoga, Yoga for Recovery, Resilience and Realization. My name is Brian G and I'm honored and delighted to be here this evening for this class. It's going to be a breath work and meditation class tonight. So we're going to do some specific pranayamas or breath control practices to get our uh, alignment, uh, interrupt our normal patterning and get our breath and awareness. We're gonna raise our breath awareness. And then uh, hopefully that will help us to activate a connection to the mind where we can be in a meditative state for our guided rest. So sort of an extended guided rest or meditation piece tonight. Um, probably, oh, well, let's see, six, seven, five, nine, 30 to 35 to 40 minutes total practice time tonight by the time we get started. So um, as always, remember that it is your practice. Do what is right for you. Listen to the wisdom of your body because we're going to be seated for a while for these breath control practices. You may want to support yourself in a chair, feet flat on the floor, underneath the knees, hip distance apart. Um, you want to have your blanket, shawl, eye cloth available as we move into the guided rest. I'll give you an opportunity to come down onto your back for the meditation aspect of the class. We'll have a long guided, a longer guided rest than normal. Um, so you may want to have supports available for that bolsters, blankets, eye shades. So let us start by bringing ourselves into ourselves, come into this place, come into the space, find a supported posture, whatever that means to you posture in which you feel supported and in which you can lengthen your spine and in which you can breathe. Those are the requirements, whatever that looks like for you, however that manifests for you, make that happen for yourself. Feel into the sensation of whatever part of your body is in contact with the earth, the mat, cushion, the chair, the seat, whatever, whatever's touching, feel that sensation of connection at that point of contact. And bring your awareness to that sensation of, of contact or connection as support. What is it like to be supported in this moment? And having established support, I'll invite you to lengthen through the side body, lengthen through the spine, lengthen through the crown. Experiment with tucking the chin slightly to feel the back of the neck release and the full length of the spine from the root to the crown. Notice if, what, what, if anything, shifts for you as the spine aligns and elongates. Maybe you feel the chest expand and the heart open. Maybe not. Whatever you feel is what you feel. And then maintaining that lengthened, aligned spine, feeling into the support, rooting into whatever's touching. I invite you to bring your awareness to your breath. Begin to breathe in and out through the nostrils, following the inhale all the way in. And the exhale all the way out. Bringing yourself into the present moment by coming into the body. Coming into the body by coming into the breath. And on your next inhale, I invite you to float your hands to your heart in a way that brings awareness to your heart space. Perhaps the left hand over the heart, the right hand over the left, maybe hands in prayer. Feel the heat and the connection between the hands and the heart. Feel the heartbeat beneath the hands and allow to rise in your heart space any one thing for which you are grateful, a sense of gratitude, perhaps just the possibility of gratitude. Turning your awareness into your heart space, see what arises when gratitude is brought to the fore. Whatever you're grateful for, or see it clearly in your mind's eye and anchor it right there at your heart space. And then having established support, come into the present moment and allow gratitude to arise. I'll invite you, if you choose, to set an intention for your practice today. Perhaps a simple intention to just keep your gratitude anchored at your heart space. Or to be in your breath. To just be in there, right there, at each inhalation. But whatever your intention is for your practice, I invite you to state it to yourself in your mind's ear. Hear yourself as you state your intention in a clear and declarative voice, as if it is already done. And then having established support, coming to the present moment, 
allow gratitude to arise and set our intention. I invite you to take a full inhale. And as you exhale, if you choose, you bow your chin to your intentional grateful heart and offer a benediction to seal your intention. Namaste. And release the hands, lift the chin, open the eyes and bring yourself present. We're going to begin with a balancing breath known as alternate nostril breath. Now you have options here. We teach mental awareness here, Beck and Yoga Project. So just bring your awareness to your left nostril. You breathe in through the left nostril, full inhalation. And then you switch your awareness to the right nostril and you breathe out through the right nostril, a full exhale. Keeping the awareness on the right nostril, you'll breathe in through the right nostril. And then switching your awareness to your left nostril, you breathe out through the left. So we switch the awareness on the exhales. And that is the pattern, in left, out right, in right, out left. Now, if your practice of pranayama involves the use of a hand mudra, then feel free to create your hand mudra and utilize your thumb or ring finger to block the appropriate nostril as you're breathing. You may see me do that at some point. We're just gonna be here for a moment or so. Remember in all breath practice that the body is very still. The awareness is on the breath and the nostril. The focus is at the brow point if the eyes are closed or at the tip of the nose if the eyes are open. Your rhythm, your pace, your breath. I'll count the first two, but my rhythm may be different than yours. So don't overthink it, just be in it. Inhaling through the left. Long, deep breath, full inhalation. Switch, exhale through the right. Inhaling through the right. Switch, exhale left. Again, your rhythm may be different than mine. That's absolutely as it should be. It's your practice. You're in the privacy of your own space doing your practice. Continue the pattern. Inhale left. Exhale right. Inhale right. Exhale left. Whether you're using the hand mudra or just mental awareness, continue at your rhythm, your pace. Your breath. your practice. It's bringing awareness to the breath, feeling the sensation of the breath in the nostril and aligning your breath. Being very still. A very balancing breath. Designed to open the narrow channel between the hemispheres of the brain, and bring equilibrium to the system.
last couple rounds here. So when you next find yourself exhaling through the left, go ahead and release your awareness, release your hand mudra for using one. Just let the hands come to the knees, palms up, thumb and forefinger lightly touching. Be very still. Just notice what if anything shifted for you feel into your own experience, being present with yourself. Release any shaping of the mind, of the breath. Allow yourself to just be still. A full inhale. A complete exhale. Our next breath is going to be a little more dynamic breath. It's going to be an inhale through the nostrils. And you're invited to open the chest and bring the arms up so that the elbows are shoulder height, the palms facing forward, sort of cactus arms, opening through the chest. And then on the exhale through the mouth, you're invited to bring your hands into fists, your forearms toward each other and tuck your chin toward your chest. So a little bit of opening on the inhale, breathing in through the nose on the inhale, breathing out through the mouth on the exhale. Wise, long, deep breaths, inhaling through the nostrils, exhaling through the mouth. Just continue your rhythm, your pace, your breath, your practice. Just full inhales and complete exhales. So feel into bringing a little dynamism, dynamic to this, if you choose. Feeling that full inhalation, complete exhalation. Now remember the inhale and the exhale are equal. Sometimes we feel like we're overdoing the exhale because of just the way things work with this. So don't overthink it, just be in it. Again, your rhythm, your breath your pace, your practice. Opening on the inhale, expanding the chest, letting the heart shine, rounding on the exhale, bringing everything into the core, into the center as you empty out through the mouth. Feeling into the power of the breath. That sense of the life force, the prana that comes on the inhale. Enervating and energizing. That sense of clearing and release. And it comes on the exhale. Relieving, finding stillness. Just stay with the pattern. A few more here.
on your next inhale. Open, just gently retain this breath. Be very still as you lift gently at the base of the spine, at the pelvic bowl, at the heart. Even though the arms are up and the chest is open, the shoulders are relaxed, the chin is tucked. Feel yourself lifting and bringing everything to the center. When you are ready to exhale, just simply exhale, release the hands down to the knees, palms up. Be very still. Notice where you feel sensation in your body here. Notice where there's a sense of energetic opening or connection. Notice for yourself what shifted in this simple practice. We use these tools in order to bring our self into awareness of our ability to regulate our mind state, which is the sense of resilience. Regardless of circumstance and experience, we have the capability and the choice. You know, into just being still. A full inhale. A complete exhale. Our next breath again is an inhale through the nostrils and an exhale through the mouth. The option is to utilize the hands on the inhale, take the arms out wide, shoulder height, palms facing forward. Again, opening through the heart. And on the exhale, we just bring the hands together in front of the face, just about touching, not quite touching, but just about touching. Inhaling through the nostrils, exhaling through the mouth till the hands are just about touching. If you like, close the eyes on the inhale and on the exhale, just blink the eyes open right as the hands are about to touch. And that is the movement. Again, we're just gonna be here, don't overthink it. Don't stress it, just full inhales and complete exhales, bringing your awareness to the breath, inhaling through the nostrils, exhaling out the mouth. Your rhythm, your pace, your breath, your practice. Inhale and exhale are equal length, duration and volume, feel into being, even though the arms are moving, the body is still very still. The awareness is on the breath and the nostrils are out the mouth. Focus at the brow point, at the tip of the nose, just feel into that middle moment when you blink where the hands are right in front of your tip of your nose. And then find your level of vigor, enthusiasm, practice, your own practice, your own rhythm, your own pace. And then notice what happens for you in your mind. You your mind might start telling yourself some stories about your arms. And remember, it's your practice. So at any time, you're going to take variations in the way that is appropriate for you. You need to bring your arms down and rest. That's fine. If you need to stop and start, that's fine. There's no right or wrong here. It's just breath control practice. We're just doing Just a little bit longer here. Feeling into this pattern interrupt. It's a pattern interrupt. Breathing in a different way than normal. 
aligning our mind and our body through the use of the breath, yoking the body to the mind with the breath. Couple more here. On your next inhale, the arms wide, gently retain this breath. Lift gently at the base of the spine, at the pelvic bowl and at the heart. Even though the arms are out, the shoulders are relaxed, the chin is tucked. Again, lifting everything to the center, being very present. And again, when you're ready, release your breath, release the holding and the lifting, sit very still, palms up, thumb and forefinger together. Allow everything to settle. Just be in your experience, notice where you are. Allow yourself to be. Be very still. You move into stillness. You practice between the realms of energizing and releasing. Between the realms of effort and ease. The integration is, an, is a practice, as is the dynamism. We have one more breath here, one more breath practice here. And so, and it's one that's rapidly becoming one of my favorites. So we're gonna breathe in through the nostrils, but we're gonna break the inhale up into seven equal parts, little sips. And when think about bringing the directing the breath up the spine, starting at the root, then the sacral area, then the navel, then the heart point, then the throat, and then the brow, and then the crown of the head. And then we'll retain the breath gently at the crown, letting everything settle. And then we'll make a complete exhale. Breathing in and out through the nostrils, seven part inhale, one long continuous exhale. Now for me, I like to think of this as breathing up the back of the body at those points that I mentioned and breathing out down the front. So it feels like a loop that may work for you, may not find your own practice in your own hand. So the hands are just gently resting, palms up for inspiration, palms down. If you feel you need a little more grounding, just be very still and allow the breath to work its way up and down the body. So I'll count the first two and then we'll fall into the pattern. So inhaling to the root, sacral, navel, heart, throat, brow, crown, and then just gently retain, no stress, no strain, just let everything settle there. 
And when you're ready, just exhale, one long continuous exhale, completely emptying the body, complete exhalation. And begin again, inhaling root, sacrum, navel, heart, throat, brow, crown, gentle retention, focused at the brow point, Eyes are closed. Gently roll the eyes to meet at the brow point, just behind the brow, just behind where the brows come together. And then when you're ready, complete, long, empty, complete exhale. And continue. Root, sacrum, navel, heart, throat, brow, crown, Gentle retention, stillness, focused at the brow point. Complete exhalation. Your rhythm, your pace, your breath, your practice. Continue your own rhythm. Being out completely on the exhale, letting everything go. And then breathing in, up the spine. Focusing on being very still at the top of the inhale. And then releasing everything on the exhale, letting go completely, emptying out entirely. more rounds here.
Ex exhale. Exhale completely. And then let go of the pattern. Release the shaping of the breath. Just be very still for a minute. And let everything settle again. Just take a couple breaths here. Releasing the pattern, allowing everything to just go. Just being still. And then move into your meditative posture. So you have your choice here to take your guided rest here in a seated posture or come down onto your mat, on your back. You choose to come down onto your mat, on your back. Allow your toes to fall open. Let your heels go as wide as is comfortable for you on your mat. Your palms come down by your hips, palms up. Lengthen through the crown. And imagine you could pull on your side ribs so that your lower spine, you feel your entire spine on the mat. Take a moment to establish yourself and provide yourself with any additional support you want in this final posture. Maybe you have an eye cloth, blanket, shawl, bolster. Maybe just finding 1% more support as you release and let go, let go. You're done. Be done. Allow yourself to be done. Release any analysis, conversation, planning or judgment. Just be still. Be in your body. Just Observe your body here at rest. And track your body from soles of the feet to the crown of the head, systemically looking for any areas of tension or tightness, constriction or contraction seeing what and where that might be in your body. And if you find any such areas, go ahead and direct the breath toward that area of tightness. And if you find that directing the breath doesn't seem to be alleviating the tightness, then perhaps try softening around what is tight. Find the area of constriction and just soften around it. Notice what happens as you soften. Perhaps you find support. Just resting. Being in this moment in your practice. Allowing everything to be just as it is right here, right now, for this moment. Finding the opening to stillness or presence. Just observing yourself, being the witness, observing your own experience. 
feeling into your rest. Taking this opportunity to just simply allow yourself to be. Observing without judgment, without commentary. Just being aware of yourself and your surroundings. Allowing yourself to be as you are. And I invite you once again to allow to arise in your heart space anything that speaks to you of gratitude. Perhaps it's the same as when we started, maybe something different arises. Whatever it is, see it clearly. And then Take the time to just hold yourself in gratitude in this space. And as you rest here in gratitude in your space, I'll take this opportunity to extend my sense of gratitude to you. Thank you so much for coming and sharing your practice. I'm honored to be here, truly. And as always, I invite and encourage you to stay here in grateful rest for as long as you like. And when you do rise, please take your gratitude and the echoes of your practice with you as you go through the rest of your day, lifting yourself and all that you come into contact with. Have an amazing day.